action. Hello and welcome to episode 71 of the Youth Squad Legends series with Harrogate Town. So we've got to be good to work without the sauce. The ingredients must be perfect. I'm going to try Alistair Lennox up at central attacking midfield because he's deserved this opportunity. Leeds United against Harrogate Town. <sighs> yeah. Go on, Olajeo. Up you go. It's just lift and run with Olegeo, and he'll power himself through. Finish. No, not that time. He's getting to, like, the Obby Jackers levels of just physically overpowered. Oi! Go on, Alan Papa. The strength on this little lad is just unbelievable. Radu Floka. Oh, it's going over Jokinen. Unbelievable finish there. From the Leeds United number 16. You can't really put yourself in a good position. Disappointment on Cartonen's face. You see this little dink. Jokinen, angles, probably spot on. Get there. Yes, turn. Alistair Lennox, look up. Look up. Come on. And it's Alan Papa with Mustafa Name outside. Go on, Mustafa Name. Way quicker than that defender. Finish. Oh! And another great chance goes begging for Harrogate Town. This is Alistair Lennox. Good find. And Alan Papa's on his way. Alan Papa goes across. Gonna have to be a corner kick. And that's a weak pass, but Alan Papa can't get it around. He's Olegeo. They've just passed it to Olegeo. And still, we can't get it in. Mustafa Name. Finally. We have got a standing tackle in. And wittiness, mate, Junior is... Just quickly move that ball onto the attack. Olegea goes down. It's a bad slide challenge. He'll get a buck in. But he has probably stopped the last attack of the half. This is where you really want the old camera. Because I don't know where this is going. But I'm going to try and lift it up. What I wanted to do was lift it into the box. And that did not happen. That's a ball and a half. <laughs> oh, they're pulling it back for a penalty. I don't believe it. And they're going to give him a red card. Mate, this game crooked. Save it, Carton, and... Oh. Yes, lads! Come on, away, away, go, 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 go! No! Oh, it's the really poor touches that are killing us. A very aggravating game of football. It was rinse and repeat. Loose control on the first touch. Leeds United pressing hard, winning it back. Missed opportunity there, because I think Leeds United are down in 18th or 19th place. Scouting, rip. Paul, he's not too bad. And he's called Tattoo VT. Petr Tillman's going to be out for four weeks with a sprained knee. A lot of players on international duty. Congratulations to Carton and Jokin and Flocker, Cosme and Kobe, Truin, Fenton, Rojas, Olegea and Palatano. That would be something. International management with Romania. Radu Flocker as captain. Try and get them to a World Cup. I think anybody under the overall of like... 75 probably should be listed for loan. Total Donko has got a higher overall now than Louis Price. We are living in that world. Even Radu Flocker's on that loan list. Bedelli is a 76? Put Bedelli in the middle. Go on. Let's see what he can do. Harrogate Town against Aston Villa. What Bedelli lacks in strength, he might make up in pace. He's going down the left hand side. Bedelli. Three on two, three on three, ball in! Oh, Cosme, let's go! Now we've got Freddie Woodward, an AI replacement for the suspended Wittiness mate, Junior. No, I wouldn't do that, although Freddie Woodward does have a range of passing. Olegea! Man, what is happening? These keepers are going mental today. Radu! Oh! Hits the crossbar! He's hit the crossbar! So it's going to work if we use Bedelli as, like... A central attacking midfielder that likes to go out onto the wings and cross in. Really, that's your best bet. You know, for a central defensive midfielder, Freddie Woodward can ball it out at centre-back. I'll give him that. Yeah, we're going to have to shut the curtains, unfortunately. I wanted to get some sunlight in, but seems like it's trying to melt my back wall. Ball to Abile Tunkara. He's not messing about with it. Lifted up Cosme. 
doesn't win the header, but it's directed in the general vicinity of Alan Papa. And you know he's going to win it every single time. There's a contested 50-50 on. Yeah, Bedelli, let's go! We're just going to have to play a different brand of football. Bedelli is going now. Freddie Woodward is Cosme on side. I mean, it's coming back anyway. I'll be happy with that decision if he's offside. Cosme, finished! Oh! Oh, the technical ability of Cosme. That's probably a Bedelli assist. Now we're getting to grips with him. Why is Freddie Woodward a brilliant centre-back? A Bile Tunkara. This is Bedelli. Oh! Free kick won by Bedelli. Olegea's on the pitch. He absolutely adores free kicks. Does Olegea? Oh, and this one's gone just to the side. Oh, blocked by Cosme. We're on it. Olegea. Yes! All right, use Bedelli again. There we go. Oh, what a... Oh, mate! That is one hell of a free agent find in that. We've put ultimate difficulty to the sword. Tunkara has had an amazing game. Alan Papa onside. Olegea, the target. Oh! And it could be there. Good block. Another chance for Radu Vlokot to get up this pitch. Of course, he's going to be the target. But instead... Oh, my goodness! Olegea has absolutely destroyed that ball! Jesus! It wasn't even the target! It's Bedelli from the corner kick! Are you joking me? Bedelli must be on a 10. You're not going to see a better header than that. 6-0. Full time. The player ratings. Bedelli, man of the match with a 10, but Olegea also got 10. I mean, I'm going to make it a fair competition. We have to give Georgie a go, but... You can't beat that. How can you beat that? He's just put up something that Carrasco does. Welcome to Yuko Ike's Haiku Chronicles with your host, Yuko Ike. No competition when Bedelli smashes it. The chance goes begging. Two-year loan offer here for D-Roy Youngerpin. Accept that. Just accept everything. Run with a very light squad. It'll all work out in the end because we'll have a team of 80 overalls. Amador! Yes! Right, Georgiev, at it. Why are we going to put on Kobe? Gonna have weapons everywhere for him. Yerson Rower up front. Good lineup. Harrogate Town against Peck Zwolla. PC Zwolla. Whatever you want to call it. They're the opponents. We're cruising in the group stage, I think. Demian Kobe back there to tackle. And he rides the challenge. Yes, Demian Kobe. Keep going. Out wide. Lovely stuff by Demian Kobe. Festus Walbrecht. Not a bad ball in. But just at the height for one of the defenders to recover. It's going to be a clearance away, a punch away by the goalkeeper. It's stopped by Stone Lukoki to tackle. Is that true in? Well done, Georgiev. Now then. Should have been a bit heavier. Allowed Yerson Rower to run onto it, but we still got this attack. We'll just spin and play in Demian Kobe. Maybe not to Mustafa name. Out wide, Pal Girth. Oh! Just a little dink into Yerson Rower would have been nice. He was clear. Could have had it at the front post. Oh, the size of Stone Lukoki in comparison to this lad. He was never going to get around Stone Lukoki. Goal kick. Pal Girth is up there attacking. And nearly made the ball there to Yerson Rower. Very close. Unlucky. <laughs> oh, go on. Yes, a Pal Girth pass unexpectedly gets through. It's Mustafa Name. Good assist by Yerson Rower. I'd love for Georgiev to win this battle. Not gonna lie, he's been in the shadows for a long, long time. Georgiev right now is playing okay. But he's playing okay for Lazar Georgiev's standards. And Bedelli didn't just play great for Bedelli. Bedelli just played great for a central attacking midfielder. Full stop. I do think there's a personal vendetta. Go on, Georgiev! Yes! Truin and Woodward are trying to outdo one another as central defensive midfielders. There is a genuine rivalry. Woodward has an amazing game. Then Truin comes in. Has an amazing game. Great ball there. Thing by D-Roy Youngerpin. Would make sense. Yerson Roa just sticks it back to Lazar Georgiev. He's a pure goal scoring attacking midfielder. So we got one that works on the inside in Carrasco, one that works on the outside, and then one that just pops in 
with the goals. The laser gets involved. 2-0. Stone, get on it, lad. What a player. And Truin makes the instant interception. And again, back to Alistair Lennox. We've got a pass inside. Oh, Alistair Lennox with a ball. Yerson Rower just getting a little bit too excited there. We've given everything to keep this clean sheet. Kravchik helping us out, sprinting back. Waste the time a little bit. Whack it up there. Full time, Arrogate Town 2. Pegs Waller, nil. Testing it slightly with the starting 11, but it's a humongous game away. Stamford Bridge hosts Chelsea against Harrogate Town. One thing's for sure, we will be bigger than them. Taller, wider. Any kind of advantage, honestly. We're also a bit slower, don't get me wrong. We've got a bit of magic with Tony Skalitsky on the wing. Oh, can't get the cross in there. Now a chance for Radu Fluka! Oh! Damn. Oh, it's a loose pass. Maciel into Olegeo. Touch around the defender was very poor. I don't know what's going on with Chelsea. Having a terrible opening to this game. Try and fire Radu Fluka. Ah, punched away by the goalkeeper. Maciel, I'm going for it. It was a great attempt, to be fair. Kravchik goes wide. Alan Papa, even though he's not tall, he's scrappy. Loves a scrap. Little dummy. Olegeo. Ah, good guarding. Back to your keeper. Well played. Press, press, press. Yes. Uh, yes. Nice work by, I think, Alan Papa there. Kravchik instead of... Say, oh, thank you very much. <laughs> Put him under pressure. Keep putting him under pressure. I pressed pause by accident. Valerie Olegea cannot stop scoring. Good clearance. Alan Papa. Unbelievable how much strength he's got. And Alan Papa will be up against Martin to try and get into the box himself. Alan Papa keeps on going. Oh! There's a slight tug, I think, by Martins at the end. Not enough to give a penalty. Unbelievable determination. Victorino, touch. Very nice. They kept it alive. They kept it alive. Put it in. Chelsea have the equaliser. Could the second half bring out a brand new Chelsea? They're wanting to turn Victor. Oh, they turned Victorino inside out. And that is Chelsea 2, Harrogate Town 1. What a difference. Season might start taking a turn for the worst and bringing out the keeper. Yeah, that was probably. The best option. Go on, Alistair Lennox, go! Open up for me! Ari, Ari, please, please! Where are you? Oh, it's Bedelli inside. Alistair Lennox! Yes! We deserve that, boys! We deserve that! I'll take it. It's a point at Stamford Bridge, which is massive for this team. But man, there was an opening there. And Chelsea looked good for 10 minutes. Did the business for 10 minutes. But all in all, struggle to cope. Funny thing is, Jerson Rowe's loan has been rejected. So he saw Burnley's style of football and went, no. I mean, the offers here are flying. Pal Girth could be going to Santos Laguna. Google has selected Podian Zongong to be increased by one potential. Best trainers at the club, Tony Skalitsky and Mark Truin. So they'll be going up by one. They're already massive in potential. Skalitsky's basically the finished product we just added another one into the scenario Jason Rower, very good training this episode so he has gone up to 85 potential and that is it for another couple of days big thanks to everybody watching this especially you guys in the premiere wave in the premiere live chat hello if you're not subscribed around here yet press the red box down below and the bell icon for mobile notifications big thanks to everybody on the right hand side supporting me on patreon i need to sort out that credit list soon because i know that it's well out of date but you know how much i appreciate that keeps everything afloat and keeps a roof over the head thank you ever so much see you next time bye bye